Hello everybody and welcome to my channel, Hey This Juanita. Well, I thought I'd do this a little different and do it on the stairs that I walk on every day. Yeah, so get those tennis shoes on. Come walk with me. Yeah, get up, get out and get healthy. It's what I'm always saying. And it's, and I live by that. So I hope you do too. If nothing else, I hope you enjoy the story because we are on day 32 and I'm gonna be talking about not giving up on your dreams. So, stay tuned for that story. And uh, I'm gonna go get more work done because I already got my computer up. And then I'm gonna meet you guys on the first floor here shortly. See you soon. Okay, you guys, well, I hope you guys are ready to walk around the perimeters of your home or get in your coat and walking outside while I share a story or two, because this is all about getting up, getting out, and getting healthy, not so much about my stories. So with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and get up the stairs so that I can get in good health. In the meantime, I'm gonna share about conquering your fears. There are so many times that people fail to uh, put their dreams out there because of either tapes that we grew up with where we were told we could not accomplish anything or it was just simply because we were too much in our heads and we feared accomplishing anything. So it pulled us back. Well, I'm gonna share a story about a gal. When I went to college and I graduated, I ended up with a job offer to teach students with disability computer concepts and also to get them certified and find them a job. Well, I had this gal that was my student. And she grew up with these tapes of that she was never gonna amount to anything. That uh, she was stupid and dumb and everything else that went with that. And so every time I would teach her something, she goes, oh, I can't do this. You're so smart, I can't, I can't do this. And I would tell her, you gotta stop telling yourself that because you can do it. This gal had a master's in psychology. And so I told her, you know what? You're the one who's sitting here with the master's degree. I just have an associate's degree. So you can't tell me you can't do this. And she said, well, yeah, but I had tutors. And I told her, yes, you may have had tutors. We all have tutors that teach us along the way of anything that we're doing. But nobody takes that test for you. You had to take that test and pass it to sit here with the master's degree. And it really started turning her thought pattern around. And she goes, but I grew up with people telling me I'm stupid, blah, blah, blah. I said, you gotta stop listening to those people. Stop listening to all that chatter that's going on in your head and just realize that you can accomplish this you know and so I'm here to tell you that you can accomplish anything you set yourself to do you just have to put your best foot forward and do what needs to be done these days there is a lot of resources out there for us that's available. And with those resources, you can accomplish anything you set your mind and goals to do. I started this filming project, business, how, whatever you want to call it. And it didn't come without interpretations. It didn't come out with thinking that I couldn't do it. But I had to get out of my head and realize that there's a lot of things that I've been able to accomplish in my life. 
And with it came fears. It came the thought of maybe failing. But the truth of the matter is, is that I succeeded. And if I succeeded in those other projects, I could very well succeed in this. I recently had a girlfriend who came over. She showed me in conversation, she showed me some videos that she does for other people. And I was in awe of her creativity, uh, her storytelling, uh, just the way she did her films were brilliant. And so I say, if you have an idea, a thought, you're creative in any aspect, you know, put yourself out there, share it with the world, you know, learn how to do it, you know, because the resources are available there. Don't put it in a shoebox. Whatever you guys do, don't put your thoughts and ideas in a shoebox and file it away for never to be seen again because that's wasted time and effort that you've already put into. Do what you need to do and accomplish it. There's people who set forward to doing a project or a business and they get only so far or they go to school and they only get so far because they're afraid of failing. And the only reason a person fails is because we get in our way. We're the only person that gets in our way of accomplishing and succeeding in anything we do. But if you don't try, you don't know where it can take you. So don't give up on those dreams and don't let anybody tell you anything different. Go for your dreams, conquer the world. If anything, it's for your own satisfaction because when you do something, whether anybody cares about it or not, as long as you know that you gave it your best, it is gratifying. So get out there, do your best, and uh, just go for it, you know. What's the worst that can happen is that you find out that it just wasn't for you or that maybe it opened another door and you were meant to go a different direction. So, yeah. With that being said, I'm on the ninth floor. I need to go get my day finished and then I'm gonna leave for the night. So, thank you for watching. If you liked this video, I hope it was of help for you. Give me a like. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button so you can catch me on other videos. And, uh, you know, just go for it. That's all I can say is just go for it. Don't let people get in your way. Don't let yourself get in the way of accomplishing anything. Okay, with that said, I will meet you guys on the first floor tomorrow. Have a great evening. In the meantime, thank you for watching.